Do you think Turnstile is real hardcore? Absolutely. No, I think it's kind of soft. It's a whole nother new era of hardcore. Neo Punk FM. What is your moshing strategy for tonight? I'm just a big guy, so you know, I just stay throw my weight around and just see if you know it's all in God's hands. Mostly just two step and fucking try and find somebody on the outskirts I can yell some shit to. I'm gonna keep the dukes up high and tight, high and tight. Someone's gonna duck at me and they gonna get the one too. That's how it's gonna be. Who are we here with today? Big 30, 30 rack, Sammy. Where do you get that name from? Man, I killed a 30 rack of fucking Coors Light at college for a pregame for the pregame. Do you have any crazy pit stories, something that happened to you in the pit? Yeah, some kid had to get carried out of the pit in an ASAP Rocky show. I was like, God damn, bro. I think I was the one that laid him out. And I was like, fuck, bro. I just held the show up for a little bit because I just came in hard as shit. I was like, ah. But I did pick him up and I helped him get on stage. So how does like old school hardcore match up to like, or how does that compare to the hardcore today? I feel like it's more more mainstream in a sense. My first introduction into hardcore was Turnstile. There's a lot of new fans that are coming in just like me that still really aren't, don't have good mosh etiquette and stuff. Like most of the people I see around here, they're all Travis Scott fans. And we all know how that shit happened. Nobody picked up anybody. Nobody tried to help anybody out. And that's the problem with those shows. That's why so many people died then. Now that we have, I say, a softer version of hardcore, it's a lot easier for fans to come in who like the moshing, like the sense of community, and just go with it. Do you think Addison Ray would survive in a uh, hardcore pit? Nah, I think she'd get the security guards to block it off for like six seconds or 10, maybe three minutes now they extended the videos, and then she'd just pop out, bro. I don't think she could take a fucking full ass goddamn shoulder check from a nigga like me, that's all I'm saying. Back up in the middle of the are you pro or anti-gatekeeping? I'm pro gatekeeping. I think if you're there when an artist is small and you're there when they're popular, you need to defend that you were there from the start. I think it's not cool that people just jump on the bandwagon when they just get popular. It's not cool. I think gatekeeping is kind of weird because the people that are gatekeeping are making it weird anyway. Just let them vibe out to their one song and everybody else will get fucking lit. Uh, I gatekeep Heelys. You ain't about it if you didn't have a pair when you were 10 years old. I will gatekeep Mario Kart for the 2DS. If you're not Mario Kart on the 2DS, you are not a real Mario Kart fan. Number three, I will to this day gatekeep the Rippingtons. Look them up. It's Weather Channel Music. Gatekeeping can be a good and a bad thing, but before you gatekeep anything, try to look at the band that you're gatekeeping. Turnstile, yeah, seems like a good band to gatekeep. Bands like this I really like because, you know, there is that sense of community in a sense. Like, you know, coming here, making friends. You know, I've seen, I've seen this dude right here over twice at some shows I've been to. Broke his tooth! He's gonna dance with me. What's like the craziest thing you've ever seen in like your 20 years of being at hardcore shows? Uh, thrice back in 2003. Um, it was at the Warp Tour actually here in Atlanta, and uh, five guys came dressed as ninjas, and they just beat up like 20 people. What is the most hardcore thing you've ever done? Most hardcore thing I've ever done was break up construction equipment, allegedly. Stay out of my neighborhood. How do you feel about the youth in the hardcore movement right now? I feel like they're on TikTok, you know what I mean? Uh, do you have any examples of, of people who are like probably like bandwagon hoppers? TikTok. Just everything on TikTok. I hate TikTok. I don't want normies listening to music I find that I like, you know? How was it in there? Uh, it was pretty awesome. I had a great time. Was that your first hardcore show? No. <laughs> How many other hardcore shows have y'all been to before? 